Hi, welcome back Lincoln Park Life. My name is Maureen and I serve buyers and sellers in Lincoln Park and the surrounding neighborhoods. Uh, today we're talking about appraisals. What happens if a buyer is willing to pay over the list price? Well, the home sells twice. First it sells to the buyer and then it has to be sold to the bank. So in a case like that, you really need to be able to support your price. So, uh, cause the bank is looking to protect its own interest. So it's gonna send out an appraiser and they will establish that the home has a value equal to the investment that the bank is making for the home. Um, they'll use properties that are similar to the subject property that have sold within the past three months and are um, in the same proximal area of the home. Um, those are often referred to as comps. Um, there's three main components to an appraisal. There's the walkthrough where the appraiser comes through and they confirm the tax records, they confirm the measurements, they take pictures, they note any upgrades that have been done to the home. Um, for condominiums, they also have to look at the fiscal health of the association. So they'll want to know how much is in the bank, um, how many units are rented, and if there are any projects that are planned because the underwriter will ultimately be looking at that as well because the bank is making an investment in that building. Um, so the appraisal will find comps in the area um, that will have closed, like I said, within the past three months that are similar in size, uh, location, and so forth. Um, and the pictures will be included in the appraisal report. So the appraisal is where the appraiser pulls together all the sales and does a comparison side by side of each of the properties um, that are similar and shows plus or minus how they stack up. And then the appraisal is sent to uh, both first the bank and then to the buyer because the appraiser actually works for the bank, not for the buyer. Um, if you're selling an appraisal and I'm sorry, if you're selling a home and the appraisal comes back low, um, it's likely the buyer is going to want to renegotiate the price. Um, so it's really important that you have a good realtor who's going to price it effectively to begin with and someone who can communicate with the appraiser and knows what brings value to your home and makes it unique from the other comparables that have sold recently. Um, when I meet with an appraiser, I always bring supplemental um, comps because I want to make sure that they know what um, makes my client's home unique but and differentiate it from the rest of the market. Um, but I, if there's a home that sells the multiple offers, then I'll bring the backup offers and I'll white out or black out the names so that uh, privacy is maintained. But that way, those are, can be used as extra data points to support the price. Um, at this point, you may be convinced that you need um, some support or guidance in the area of appraisals, um, but uh, or you may have an idea, the idea that you don't know where to start, but I'm here to help. Um, just send me a message or give me a call at 312-953-7811. Um, no pressure, just I'm looking to hear, looking to help if I can. Um, if you live in Lincoln Park or you're thinking of moving here and you want further information, you can always stay informed on Instagram and Facebook. Um, please feel free to post any questions below and I will be sure to get back to you with answers on that. Thanks so much for joining me and have a great day.